Lesson 1, Identities, Theory Given that cosec theta equals 1 over sine theta, sec theta equals 1 over cos theta, and cot theta equals 1 over tan theta, prove that 1 tan theta equals sine theta over cos theta, 2 sine squared theta plus cos squared theta equals 1, 1 plus tan squared theta equals sec squared theta, and 1 plus cot squared theta equals cosec squared theta. First of all, what we'll do, we'll actually just draw the diagram. Okay, and that is, let's have a look at this. Okay, we'll draw a little triangle here. And we'll call that one A, that one B, and that one C. Little right angle there, and there's theta. So in part one, we can see that the sine of theta is equal to A over C. The cos of theta is equal to B on C. And the tan of theta is equal to A on B. Alright, now the tan of theta equal to the sine of theta over the cos of theta. That's what we have to prove. We have to prove this. So the left hand side is equal to A on B. The right hand side is equal to sine theta which is A on C divided by B on C is A on C times C on B, C on B, the C's cancel out and you've got A on B which equals the left hand side. Therefore the tan of theta is equal to the sine of theta over the cos of theta. Okay now before we said here the cot theta equals 1 over tan theta so we can also see that the cot of theta is equal to the cos of theta over the sine of theta. Okay in part 2 we have to prove that the sine squared theta plus cos squared theta equals 1. Right. So the left hand side is equal to, now remember the sine of theta up here was A on C. So that's A on C squared. And the cos of theta, if you remember, was B on C. It's B on C all squared. So that's equal to A squared plus b squared over c squared. This is a right angle triangle. We can see here from Pythagoras that c squared equals a squared on a squared plus b squared. So we can replace the a squared with b squared by c squared and that equals 1 which equals the right hand side. So we've got a very important result with sine squared theta plus cos squared theta equals 1. Variations of this are sine squared theta is equal to 1 minus cos squared theta, just takes across the other side, and of course the cos squared theta is equal to 1 minus sine squared theta. Right, now the other ones. We have to show that 1 plus tan squared theta is equal to sec squared theta. Now rather than resorting to a's and b's, what I'll do, I'll simply take this result, which we already proved, theta equals 1, and I'm going to divide through here by cos squared theta. So I'll divide that by cos squared theta. In other words, divide both sides by cos squared theta. 
because this is tan squared theta and that's 1 so it becomes 1 putting it the other way around plus tan squared theta equals and 1 on cos is 6 so that's 6 squared theta okay similarly we can do the same sort of thing with the last uh, identity I've proved that 1 plus cot squared theta equals cosec squared theta. And divide this time I'm going to divide sine squared theta plus cos squared theta equals 1 by sine squared theta. So I'll write that down. Sine squared theta plus cos squared theta equals 1. And now we'll have this over sine squared theta over sine squared theta over sine squared theta and of course that's 1 plus and cos on sine is cot cos squared theta and 1 on sine is cosec and they're the important identities these also can be changed around you can say that cot squared theta was cosec squared theta minus 1 and you can say up here that tan squared theta equals 6 squared theta minus 1 if you take that 1 across to the other side and these are very important identities which we'll be using in the examples that follow in the next lessons.